And they've got a decent crossfire with a player to the good. They're going to need to land some pretty beefy shots on this. Demosic can just now swing. Forced out by the Molly. Good work from Mo, but the trade's there. Lovely work from Angel. Really just consistent play on the side. Just waiting for that first bit of contact and taking the wide peak. It gives them pretty much full lamps control. And Fnatic going to have to back up initially. Mo will find a kill into Demosic. Shadow now. Oh, actually, ooh, that was close, actually, because he was caught the... Okay. Didn't quite catch the kills, but I was going to say it was close there because he caught the vulnerable. You're going to see a little bit of a clear as they come through. Chat going to be playing from Elbow. Nice work from Doma to find Xiao. That's a bit of a mistake from Xiao to be that able to be that picked up for nothing. That, 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 that was just a crossfire to be held. That was unnecessary to go down like that. And now you're going to see most on a build up. They were paranoid about the flank earlier. And now that paranoia is going to build again. Bit of a... Curious choice from Demosic to try and make that mad dash and FPX. Yes, they find two, but it's Zipan now on the side. Now 1v1 up against... Oh my <laughs> word, Zipan <laughs> finds Mo on the swing. Now, yeah, we know Zipan's got aim for days. Actually, Doma making his way back through the spawn now. Back over towards B site. So, FPX are going to get themselves a 2v2. Chak actually posted with a Bucky inside site here. Tap comes through and he will find the headshot. The Zipan, the Bucky does not miss at that range. If he can find anything else here, just... Lurking inside this smoke for the time being. Okay, they've given away most of their positions by this point, but it doesn't really matter. It is just Angel alive. And these untradeable kills being garnered. <laughs> FBX start getting aggressive. The timing for Jack. He didn't spot Jack. both of these players. Yeah, but the cross is pretty... Yeah, but there we go. That's that's going to be a spike plant. This this is one that Fnatic will be kicking themselves about, getting yeah. overly aggressive when they had so many advantages. Unnecessary spike to push planted. down and give away guns like that. Give away opportunities and force that rotation back towards A. That vulnerability was there. Now, Fnatic looking to do some damage all the way back through. They still have their vandals. And look at this face coming out from Zipan. Tries to do the early damage. He gets the info, loses life for it. And now goes forward. Old popped. Shadow found. 2v2. Now 2v2 begins, but time is still dwindling. Keep that in mind. Having to clear these two angles is quite tricky. They're complementary in the fact that they're deep no angles to play with. There we go, Ultimate. Is Pop just going to buy some time? Doma's going to go on the hunt, though. He needs to get there quickly. <laughs> it's predicted, but it doesn't matter. And now the 1v1. And time has gone, and Demosic is there, and all he had to do was play safe. It does mean they're a little lighter on that hooker control, but now already the utility comes through, and the side is going to come in. Boaster, though, with the op. That's the, that's the little bit of a change up. It's just got to be careful here. Mo actually swinging all the way through that smoke. He will get one kill, but quickly traded out. Jack still over here, an elbow, and there you go. Ten seconds left. Yeah. Come down to the wire, but the spike will get planted here. I'm down to a 1v2 here. Shadow and Demosic. Again, they have the opportunity to flash is perfect. Mystic completely blind from that one, but the information has gone over. They're going to know exactly where Mystic's approaching from. I'm amazed on that tie. The double face as well. That's really yeah. nice. Not They're doing their very best to not allow a 1v1 to come from this. Yes. So, again, that's quite... You can see Mystic's trying to work for it. He is desperately trying to work for it. Even the angles he's facing are, are to try and give that 1v1, but they're not allowing it. They've fallen away to a deeper angle now. Playing that timing really nicely. This round, Mystic is not being given the chance. Steam 6 done with that. He's going to put it to bed. He caught Doma underneath the window. Oh, no. The smoke just not popping early enough. Boaster will fall in quick succession. Chak 2. Oh, the timing was so unfortunate for that smoke there. The spy cam from Demosic onto the tube. The clear underneath. Mystic now, Spectre in hand, will find one. But Demosic closes that one out with his third on the round. On two for FPX, even with the ults. Shot Dude, Mo. And just waiting for somebody to show their hand. Both of these players so low. And actually, Shao going to fall Demosic immediately afterwards. The wall dropping. The perfect time there. Zipan will find one headshot in consolation. But Boaster themselves in a 3v4. So definitely doable for them. Full HP. A couple of flashes still left available. And actually, Doma going to find a good kill. And a second as well. Zipan will fall. Two back-to-back -back headshots there from Doma. Showstopper gets popped. Angel now looking to regress back out. Nowhere to run. Oh no, the showstopper. Oh no, it does catch him. I think Doma just caught a glimpse of him there. Chow will find one more kill there with the Hunter's Fury. He does have a shock dart as well, but can it come through before the defuse? He's sticking it. He's going to get the defuse on that one. Fnatic will get it. Chow actually going to find both kills way onto site. So maybe anticipating this hit perfectly, to be quite honest with you. No blind notifications, so they know it's 
potentially behind the smoke that FBX are positioned. Actually, that second flash is really good, but he can't swing quick enough on it. He will find Shao regardless, though. The Seekers go out. That's going to reveal Angel's position close by, and he still wins it. Zipan will get a kill elsewhere, but Fnatic already. M numbers of booster. He just plucked Zipan out of the sky. <laughs> Those Seekers just yeeted the other way as well. That <laughs> we laugh entirely. <laughs> Diva sick though is on the site. This is still kind of tricky. Look at the time. They've got 10 seconds. What are you going to do with this? Chak has won them this round. Maintaining that long yep. control was formidable. Up to the fight, then why not go for it? He's going to take the wide swing on this one. And now the wall comes down. The crossfire re-engages, but by now the spike is planted. Oh, Angel actually managed to get himself out of heaven there. Mystic will find that one. Demon Sick responds onto Doma, but all the kills going in favor of Fnatic right now. And now they bring it to a 4v1. Shadow will fall. Fnatic will tie things up 6-6 six, six for this half and definitely didn't feel like a 6-6. Six, six. And look at the hooker presence here. This could be a bloodbath outside, but Shadow will draw first blood. I thought Booster had that one, but Shadow somehow claimed it. This could be Doma. Quick little satchel, buying some time, getting a new angle, double dips down, but he has to now do something. No. Unable to make the shots quite find their placement here. Now, Long's a problem. This is a nice little post plant. Jack's just going to spam on through. Angel's dead. Isolates another. Uh oh, FPX. We start swing bullets. No, out of nowhere. But Xiao doubles down himself. And he knows all too well. But look at this the decay, the vulnerable. It's all there. He needs the fight. And he ain't going to get it. Mystic with the fadeaway. Just find Xiao. And the pissed around is fanatics and in some style. They can't clear it out right now. Shadow's going to send it down, but it doesn't Alton really George matter at this point. There we go. Baits out the ultimate, but it buys more time. Chow's putting in damage, but the time. It's gone. Yeah, it's gone. Clutch. Exactly what I was talking about there. Those, but the, the ultimate progress just becoming... Towards Hookah, but... Still, I I mean, this is this is a decent plan, decent post plan with the players on long as well. They're gonna be funneled through and the crossfire is gonna be right. Keep your eyes on the players kind of sitting towards long. You're gonna have most of them catching the kills, and there they are. Chak and Boast are doing incredibly well. Diva Six there, but it's a little late in the day in the trades. Again, this is what I mean. Great post plant crossfires coming in. Leaving hookah room open, but taking long control. You can't get to the side without crossing out. Couple that with CT presence. You're in a wonderful position. It works so so well and now Demasic, good flank trick shot but good luck getting booster out of this he's just holding both the orbital strike both of them are bolts no matter what drives me mad about fanatic is they'll sweat their asses off to get ready for the likes of fpx but they'll almost drop like a first round game against people that are nowhere near as tricky as these guys to play against <laughs> But for now, FBX is going to put up a good try in this one. Now, what do they have ready for the post this time? <laughs> this is what they have. The if you allow them to get the spike, you're probably not going to get the defuse. So you kind of need to win before that point because this is what happens. 12 to 6. And once again, there is not an answer for that post plant. You either have to come up with one or you're going to end up like this. 12 to 6. We're back all the way under under heaven. That's it. Actually, don't clear that angle. Chow down to 37. Eight people find one, but Chow trades out. Fnatic now on the verge. 25 seconds and, and everything's going their way. They seem very well prepared. They look unflustered. They have not been pushed. And now one player remains in this Dimasic. This has been a show of strength for at least the composition. Once again on the attack, I feel as though this composition, if you do not have your answer, you're going to end up very much like Dimasic is here. A 1v3 where, yeah, you may get two of the players dead, but it's always going to be that third. And that third is going to be the consistent <laughs> problem. And as you can see, time being bore here, Demasic knows he's, his days are numbered. And there it is. Chat to finish out 13 to 6. Attack map one. From FPX, of course, on the attack. Beautiful work from Mystic. That's instantly going to halt it. Buys a little bit of time for the readjust. Isolate Zip and beautiful play from Mystic. I love that again. Big fan of Mystic so far. I've been liking what he's doing. Keep in mind that play that came out on just that previous map. But it's Chak now playing oh, around the verge. Can he control it? No. Just unable to tap so perfectly towards Angel, so it's still a 3v3. The important thing to note is the one member Fnatic still... Okay, he's going to rejoin now, but obviously that wall in heaven is going to buy them a little bit more time, and actually all three members of FPX going to commit to site here. No flashes left on Boaster, so you can see him setting up a fault line for his teammates now to retake towards Hell. FPX playing this one pretty deep now. They're just going to hold on to the backside of Pillar. He's an old post plan, especially with that flash. Look at the HP. It's dwindling, what? though. 
Mo gonna find Shadow. Doma are gonna try and clear through. Time is gonna be a fast wall. wall goes up. That's incredible. We still have that in check. Angel has to give it away now. Not much more to be done. Mo's got him covered. Lovely work and keeping the wall that late. Yeah. Out. Finding that. I'll be looking a little bit more pinned in. Both the players kind of more dedicated towards site. They might need some support soon. That's it. The double swing comes out on both sides there. Both are now stuck on default. He's only got one flash left in the aftershot. The pop that early tries to get it. And actually, Angel still got to come out on top of that one, even though I think that was potentially a team flash from Shadow. We'll give them site control. And actually, FBX find themselves in a 4v2. Okay, a 2v2. Scrap that. Close angles still can work pretty well, though, for FPX. So this is where things get a little bit trickier for Domo. He needs to find a clean 1v1, and he does flies in for it. And sadly, Zipan's just a little bit quicker than he is on this one. Mystic. How much damage can you do from up there? Let's see. Turn the flash. Wall goes up. That's one. Need some more. Mm, couldn't quite make the second. Mo was isolated back from the flash, so he wasn't able to kind of create that kind of stand-up crossfire. So now the site's going to be taken. Interesting wall to kind of funnel them through this way, so plant to be happening. Uh, the clearing back site, so that should be safe. But there's still players up towards heaven. Uh, Angel. Angel. Chak just, just had a little floor nap, but... It's not okay. Doma now is going to play it back through. And Dima 6 down here. Here we go. Doma. Doma. Doma still finds two there, but the flash came through to clear hell. And I'm not sure if a second player on Fnatic maybe caught a team blind there, but... Too risky. And this is a stalemate. Mystic going to give away a little bit of his health, but... He's into a slightly deeper angle and confirms information. This is literally going to be a 4v4 for his site. If yeah, FPX like decide to force this, yeah. I mean, you could post up one player towards A and then just hit back towards B. I'm not sure why Dima6 is trying to cross when they know that there was a chance for an op to come out. Not really the the, the right move here. Left. And now Angel's going to force his way forward. Another player towards the site, and there's Bose. Nice again. The Bose has been giving so many opportunities to do you just fine with this. It's, it's not been Ooh. particularly tricky until Shao. Got the rest and somehow got Boaster. Shadow's pinned in one. I'm pretty sure they're very aware where Mo may be, but Mo's still finding Demastic. Demastic's having a... Excuse me? Shao? I, got I don't want to watch this round ever again. Both these teams are probably not loving this. It's been a bit weird, but Fnatic win it. But we had... Is tricky crossfire angles on site. Actually, Angel managed to get all the way deep onto ramp and Demastic finding that kill. Actually sways it back in favor of FPX. The wall goes down on site now, and that's going to... Break a lot of sight lines, allow FPX to play very passive behind it. Your duty is not over. Res comes in. Fnatic going for this, but Dimasig kind of threading the needle on positioning. Yeah, exactly that. Just being a pain in the ass. They, again, they're last scene destroyed. in heaven, so they're going to be a little paranoid about it, but Angel's found great positioning me. again. And my oh my. Fnatic need to walk away from this one. That's going to be about that. Still 100 HP. And FBX not forcing the issue just yet. Most are actually going to pop the rolling thunder through heaven here. Mo going to get caught in a trap wire there. He's got no op option but to challenge. And Xiao will find that one. The Fnatic will lose two players. Mystic, though, he's going to find one in response. Over on the ropes, the paranoia is huge. That's going to stop this push altogether. Actually, the fault line, huge, perfect from Boaster. Huge work from Fnatic to hold this down. Shadows. Mystic again. I, I have to say, Mystic is quickly becoming one of my more favorite players to watch. I loved what he did on the previous map. And right now, just being able to buy time back away doesn't overextend. Does need to keep track on this. The smoke dissipating soon. Holds a passive angle. And now with 35 seconds. FPX have the numbers. Ah, oh, Mystic. Crossfire placement just being a little off on that left. one. Maybe just kind of that kind of... A little bit of a glance, but not with full purpose. But Boaster's going to do it for him. Find Shao, but Boaster's kind of surrounded here. He's got Cypher slowly flanking him, but the Rays is about to come around this corner. Zipan and Shadow. Pretty first fight there, and Boaster loses it. We've got 10 seconds, and that should be a spike plant, and I don't think Doma can really Ten stop it. Left. Big thing there. It may look planted. like Zipan's just kind of challenging 1v1. The Shadow playing anti-flash is crucial there, anticipating the push from Boaster of all people. <laughs> I mean, did just catch a glimpse there, but the spy cam gonna slow him down an awful lot. Finds himself in a 1v3, a lot to do here, but FPX just need to hold this setup. 
You have Demosec holding on to rafters. It's a tall order, to say the least. Demosec will clean it up. FPX will bring it 7-2 here. Be aware of this over towards those B-Halls. It's a very common thing to do if you take mid. The team pushes on their way back. I didn't see so it. Zipan squats the barrel. Beautiful oh, one from no. Zipan. That's exactly the composure that we love about this. Now, Mo does find a trade back in that's catching the straggler through middle. But by now, Angel's actually further ahead than they'd expect here, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, there it is. Angel gonna find Doma. He even gets another <laughs> remaining. Such control from Angel. And it's beautiful work across the board for FPX. It's gonna be very difficult not to. Okay, Spike. 10 seconds left. Spike planted. <laughs> Just accept, fair enough. All right. Yeah. Yep, yeah, no worries. Um, Angel's found Boaster anyway, so I guess no problem really came from that. Mystic's gonna dive in. Does have to do Angel, surprisingly, and most found Dimasic. This is oh, no. a wacky round already. Mystic's doing great work, but the spike still needs to be cleared, and there's still two players there. Rest comes in, so a 3v2. <laughs> no utility. Yeah, lacking utility. Exactly that. Zipan finds Mo. No trade comes in. You can see Zipan just backs away. Means that they have to swing around wider, opens up towards the Sage in the off angle, which is Xiao, and he doesn't need to be set up for success. He finds nice it well enough on his own. That's it. Second flash goes up. Angel does catch a team flash off of that one. And actually, they're going to isolate this kill potentially. How is he still getting killed there? How has he gone unchecked? He got tagged on the spy cam. How? They literally tagged him with the spy cam. Boys towards sight. Flash is ready. Teammates beware. Here we go. Zipan on the swing. That was a little bit ambitious. But Dimasek showing him how it's done until finally Boaster and Mo start putting up some numbers. Now, by this point, though, it's a 2v2. Now, Fnatic have had to bring what they can to the fight, right? Like, this is this is the stand they're making. So, oh, Boaster. Angle almost had it there as well. He's got a good read where most of these players are. Yeah, trying to isolate Shadow as best he can. Great work from Boaster. I mean, Shadow, that should be a spike plant now. Yeah, as soon as Xiao starts knifing that wall and ropes, they know they can take the 2v1 comfortably. Last uh, as I say that, that was a 1v1, not a 2v1 boaster. Or out in the open there as Mystic was on the reload. And actually, Xiao going to catch a head there. Halfway. No way. Three quarters. No way. Embarrassing. Embarrassing. Just looks like a brute force more than anything. I saw utility on the way. They're going to create the path, but yeah, just Doma just receives us a chest full of lead as soon as he tries to leave that ledge. And Demon Six is going to keep attention turned towards B main until he feels a bit more vulnerable. He's now starting to sweat a little bit. There's a couple more problems sign him out in the open, depending on Shadow. Look at Angel though. 3v3, and you're right. It's Angel coming around the back. They've seen that they wanted to get that rotate going so they can easily read into this. Yeah, Mo still has the wall. He's actually going to invest this onto defensive spawn outside heaven, but Shadow and Divasic there to catch it before it reinforces. It will be dealt with quickly. 35 HP on Mo and another 15 so seconds or so on that heal. So FPX are quick about this. They can capitalize off of that. It is planted for heaven right now, so Mo got to be the one to run the clock down for his teammate. Mm. How does he play it? This is quite nice in the smoke as well. I like that. It's going to buy a bit of time. Give him a favorable that fight. Yeah, and it does. Able to use the, the, the smoke incredibly well. Dima 6 now timing is not on his side at all. No. He's going to be able to... he's got the heal. Yeah, look at that. Sage dips out. Gorgeous. Gorgeous work. And that's time bought. That's a round win right there. Just being able to kind of buy that time, win that 1v1, utilize the smoke. Really nice synergy between the remaining two for Fnatic and a deserved third on the board here after what was a bit of a rough start. So he nailed the landing. Oh, really well done. Like I said, Mo, uh, I mean, yes, his job is to run the clock down there. Scenario is very tricky. Nice little flash coming out as well. Dimasic just going to dip down. Mo playing up top by heaven. Shao, Shao. don't do that. Two shotgun shells just pumped through. Dimasic! Oh, the timing on the swing. They both fell back to hit that reload. Now, Boaster, tall task at hand. Can he save his side in a 1v2? That was a 1v3. The smoke comes up. He's going to be dipping away through that. 50 seconds. Spike collected. He's he's off ski. You see already the rotation coming out from Angel. With that audio cue here. The, the one thing is, I mean, both of them are going to be able to upgrade the weapons here. It's taking a long time for Boaster to come and get this spike down. He's going to plant it for main. Only has his fault line left, though. So, going to have to try and isolate one of these kills here. Shadow 
Down to low HP. Obviously can't heal himself on the sky. No way Boaster tries to walk back heaven here. No way. Okay. He's thought thought of, thought of second of it. A little off. Yeah. If if he'd if he'd bounded to us straight away, then fair. He's actually played this quite nicely though. Gun barrel shows, gets one. Oh, oh he thought the sorry. second was on the site. Oh, nice attempt, Boaster. Honestly, that was a really valiant attempt at that. I, I can't discredit him by any means. Trying to clutch it out as best he could, but 13-3, it's, it's a whitewash, boys. Spin on. Yeah, check. Well, time to back away. No, no, no problems arising just yet, but certainly feeling the pressure mounting now. I thought I'm going to clear him all the way off short, so he's got to... I'm a little deeper onto site, but left. body stacked up on either side. Demon Sick and Angel will actually find the entry and the second kill conversion. Also, Mo will respond with one, but all the kills now in favor of FBX. And Mo stuck in hell will find one, but leaves Mystic in a 1v3. Actually, the wall not blocking off, so Spike planted. have to creep past the wall initially. He needs to find a kill now, though. Lock runs down. FBX are going to know something's up. Oh, it's not pretty. Quite find it. Look, if, here we, here's here's the thing, right? I love the ghost. See now exploring C Link. A little bit of a pivot back from this chat. Got to be careful here. Ah. Check and pull away. They need the pressure from the other side. They need that kind of like oh. overwhelming pressure, and they get it exactly right from Fnatic. Kill goes up. Early progress made by FPX. They don't. I guess they do have C Long control. Yeah, uh, Mystic was kind of left on an island there. As soon as that smoke dissipated, and Garage was uncontrolled they're now in a bad predicament here boaster trying to use those flashes to stay alive allow mo a second to play but now here you can see the flashes right so back blind. blind as a back could do nothing see you later or overzealous peek towards doma there from demon sick but angel on the trade absolutely fine as long as it's tradable no problem now a 3v1 for Chak and nothing left in the kit to play with i guess the alarm bot just giving up now timing's gonna be Factor. Does he find a isolated kill? Yes, no doesn't take damage. So now game back on. This is where things get a little bit more fun. Jack might be able to get the player on the side, but he's got to move quick. And he does. Jack remaining. takes okay. down Shadow and now a 1v1. He knows that his angel alive, though. Does he know where he is? That plant is specifically for long. Definitely saw it. Now he saw him. The cape gives it away, at least for a second. And timing being played with Angel doesn't lose these. And away we go, Jack. Back it out. Keep the gun. Look towards the next round. The timing, the pace change there was certainly dramatic. I mean, that quick garage control take after losing out to the Omen before. If it pays off for the Mystic here, he's going to be waiting patiently. They'll check it. That's one. That's two. A third. No, not to happen left. this time. But Mystic doing great damage and also finding all that information. Spike, you can see the speed up here. Zipan just wants to get on site, but the Molotov's going to stop him. No way to get past that. That's going to buy a good chunk of time. You can see Breach now lingering in the background. Dimasic may be able to catch some of the flank here, but he Oi, needs to be more proactive on this. He's going to have to push it now. Around we go. Bye-bye, Mo. And now Spike to go down. No, denied. Huge work from Jack. That's all he had to do. Now they have to live. Two seconds. One. Safe. With this. So they've cleared CT. So they're just going to gamble it. Maybe a little here. So there's two players coming up long. Angel posts up some utility, allowing Demasic a bit more safety to play in. Play Apparently not. What? Doma. Doma. Okay. Okay. A 1v3 for Angel now. The plant is favorable, but the position is Mystic comes around and says goodbye to him. But that oh. shot, Doma. Uh, that Someone was no check him, PC. <laughs> And here we go. Spike is down. Let's see if they can deal with the next layer of pressure. No, Doma and Mo have fallen in quick succession, too. This is a problem now for Fnatic. They've got three players standing, two from the C connector and one from the A side. And, well, the, the ult wasn't needed this time around. Good intentions all together. But as we can see, Angel still lurking, keeping himself safe for that post plan in case required. But so far, Shadow's fine. He doesn't need the help. Boast has gone down. And the last two are locked in from that C connector. Oh, Demon Six found Mystic. And Jack can't live no more. Yeah, clean round from FBX again. Just finding those first two kills seemingly out of nowhere. It flash off some of this pressure into sewers. Demon Six got himself halfway up the ramp already. And actually the paranoia immediately negated it once again by Bosa's flash. But he has none left now. So he needs to take a fight. He will find 
Be with second on the way in. Zipan will trade that out though. Mo Forty got it all to do, but nothing there. Chaka will respond with two kills of his own, but it's all going in favor for FPX right now, to be honest. One enemy remaining. Okay. How long that continues for Good Mystic recovery. isolating Shadow there, making it comfortable for them. And yeah, the 2v2's won. Be a lot of weight put towards. I guess that's Chak waiting on the other side towards C. This yeah. is gonna be really rough to handle. Yeah, he's, he's overwhelmed. Too many too many dangerous angles there. He backed into kind of that 50-50 and with Dimasix Lurk coming in through B, he's made it a problem and a big problem of that. Now, there could be an equating factor of Mystic. Keep your eyes on him. No, oh. Dimasix still gets the kill on him? No way. Oh Hold dear, on. and now both- Oh, he got tagged. Oh, this is hard to watch. A very well constructed hit, but you could feel that pressure mounting on C. You could indeed. Actually, this is the one round where we saw Fnatic flex out on A and immediately the pivot comes from FPX. They know that's going to be a two or three man push down A long and Diva Sick will clean that one up with the third. Lurk through B just finding so much value out here. Oh, look at that timing. That just peeking just ahead of the flash there. Chak will draw first blood. Angel will fall. We try and re-explore anything else. Shao will find Boaster elsewhere. Is that the hit coming through on the B? Yeah, Diva 6 position. Not anticipated there. Spike is planted, but Fnatic find themselves in a 2v4 here. We'll find the first, but Diva 6 responds with two with the frenzy there. Back to back headshots and. Diva 6. I say that lightly, but it is under control. Escaping the site might be a little trickier. And look at that retake now coming in. FPX give themselves the time to get there, and now Zipan's found Mo. That is beautiful work from FPX. Pinning Fnatic to the side. Boaster, it's all on the IGL hits. Try and save this round. The reload comes in, but Angel is quicker. Bold. All the timing's going to be... This is huge. Oh, he does get spotted on this, though. This should speed up the pace from the other two, which could open up a potential for Demasic, but by now, no damage has really been done. So Demasic doesn't wait on the... Oh! Demasic's no adjustment on Doma. Unbelievable. And while that happened, Angel just found Mystic. This is a 2v5 that's now a 2v2, and there's that ultimate in play. Information now relayed. Time to get on the boots and get running. The spy cam, just keep an eye on it. It's still positioned over on C side, so expecting to make use of that in this retake scenario. It's spotting the long cross as well, and that's he's going to get the tag onto Jack, so that's big information here. They are actually going to opt to come back and play long. You see, we do have the Hunter's Fury online, so just opting to play a strong post plant here. And actually, they're going to get halfway on the defuse already. Oh, he didn't get the halfway. <laughs> Mo. Lovely timing. Waiting for it. I don't know how he's going to dig these two players out. Banking on one to peak. Now they don't need to. Job done on this front. Yeah, this is nice from Fnatic. Keeping composure after having a really rough time, honestly. Getting to this. Remaining. Shouldn't be happening. Now, do they know if it got to halfway or not? They don't, but it didn't. Dima sick with a this wondrous is so sick, round. Man. But still, the round overall will be Fnatics. They've seen enough. They've seen something and they're sticking around now. Yes, they got Zipa. Doma, you are worth your weight in gold right now. That was so well done from him to be able to find that second kill and kind of keep this one safe. Now, Spike to be planted. And again, yes, we do have Dima sick and we do have Angel in this one still, but. Not really in a great position for... How? He's just slipped under. He's just ignoring that turret. It's just a pest. He doesn't care. But there you go. Chak. Gonna keep control of that. Try and defend his his little boy. The little turret that could. And now a 1v2 for Angel. Got the lurk though. Yeah, it's pretty dirty, isn't it? That time's dwindling. Yeah. I think this one's gonna slip away from him. And as you said, that lurk coming in from Boaster. Very well timed. Brilliant positioning. Good work from Fnatic. Keep in mind, these two teams like to play a very cautious game. Ultimates very much in the pocket of FPX for now. Placing swarm for swarm grenade out. Shao will find Boaster, and this is again off the back of this heavy lean by Fnatic towards A. The Aldo and Ashley. It's going to be the green light for Doma to pop the showstopper and try and convert that one, but. Rolling Thunder comes through. Look at the TP. Oh. Demon Sick playing perfectly off the back of Angel's ultimate. Spike is actually all the way back in A lobby right now. Oh, sorry, outside window. And the full rotation from FBX has got them guessing. Now, Zipan actually going to get Shao back on his feet. And that brings it to a 2v5 left. for Chak and Mo. Chak got to find one or two kills on this Lurk inside B right now. He does have the lockdown at his disposal, but this is a tall order. 
a very tall order for Fnatic to close this out. All right. So they should be... Uh, how how methodically does Angel clear? Let's see. It is Angel, so... It, it, oh, he gets it as well. I thought Shaq might have had Angel there. there. There could have been like a little room for work. Mo trying to... Oh my god, Angel. Angel just sees their hopes and yep. dreams and just like crushes it in his palm. At least open things up. There's Shaq going to try and control towards C and a little bit of B, but where does this force the fight? It brings Dimasic. the fight and Dimasic locked and loaded, ready to go. He's doubled down. Mo puts him to bed, but by now... Looks like Fnatic might just be done, and look who's waiting at the back of sight. Couldn't check it, didn't see it. Spike goes down, and there's Shadow appearing from one FPX. <sighs> Regain composure and get match point under the belt. They close out, to be honest. I mean, uh, I made a comment.